and welcome back to my channel. Um, today I have a grocery haul to share with you. I can tell that the days are getting longer and brighter because it is 526 when I'm filming this and usually it is really dark and um, the lighting is still pretty good here. So it is nice that um, the days are getting brighter and the days are getting longer. It's just um, shows us that a spring is coming although we still have so much snow here in nova scotia it feels like um, the spring will never come um, we actually have a ton of rain coming um, this weekend uh, anyway i have a grocery haul to share with you i actually uh, did two separate um, grocery orders today this morning after i took the kids to school emily and i went right to walmart and we went and picked up the things that we needed there and then this afternoon i was just kind of looking through the superstore flyer and decided that i would do um, a curbside pickup rather than going to the store um, I didn't actually pick that order up yet, so I don't have that to uh, share with you yet, but I will share with you share it with you when I go to pick it up. Um, I don't often do the curbside pickup. I was going to do it because I found an email um, that said I could get 10,000 uh, points if I placed an online order of $100 or more. And so I did that, but then when I went to put in the code, I realized that that email um, had expired a couple of weeks ago. So anyway, I already had all the items in my cart, so I figured I may as well just go ahead and do the curbside pickup. So I'll pick that up after um, a little bit here. I think it's supposed to be ready between 5.30 and 7, so I will probably be getting a call soon saying that it's ready. I don't usually do the curbside pickup because I like to go in store and um, kind of see, you know, what's on sale and what's on the 50% off rack. And I realized as I was making supper that I forgot to get a potato. So um, I will have to pick those up another day, I guess. Um, anyway, so everything came from Walmart and Atlantic Superstore. Um, I will show you my Walmart haul here. And then when I pick up my Superstore um, groceries, I will share that with you. Um, as well. Um, anyway, today my total was $138.37. I just ran into Walmart for, you know, the a few snack things and milk and just the things that are generally cheaper in Walmart. And then I will go to Superstore and, um, and get my produce. But this is everything that we picked up at Walmart. I'm also using a new microphone. I purchased a new microphone. So I hope that um, the sound is nice and clear and you guys can hear me okay. Um, I picked up a bag of Smart Food Popcorn. This is the big value size bag. It was $5.47. We love Smart Food Popcorn. It's one of our favorites. I picked up two buns of whole wheat bread. These were $2.87 in Walmart. I keep saying a Walmart, but everything came from Walmart. Um, when we walked in the store, um, the lady working there was putting out all the Valentine's things um, on the 50% off rack. So I picked these up for Audrey for next Valentine's Day. I thought that she would like these little um, mermaids and unicorns. And then they come with a little um, wooden stick that you can scratch them. So they were $3.48, so they were half price. So I paid $1.74. So I picked up two of those. I didn't get any for Ben because they didn't have any boy ones. But now it's just to remember next Valentine's Day that I have those. Um, sandwich bags, they're always cheapest in Walmart. I was all out of sandwich bags. Parchment paper, I think was $3.27. I can't remember how much the sandwich bags were. I gave my receipt to Emily and I think she um, left it in the van. Um, apples, Audrey loves these um, apples from Walmart. These were $5.47. We were all out of jam, so I just picked up some raspberry jam. That was $3.47, I believe. Maple syrup, we were also out of. That was $9.47. Um, vinegar was $2.47. I was all out of onion soup mix. That was also $2.47. These little crispy minis were $0.97. Cents. They didn't have a whole ton of flavors to choose from, so we picked the sea salt and black pepper and the cheddar flavor. Two packages of applesauce, that's always cheapest in Walmart, $2.17. Um, the appleberry unsweetened and just the plain apple unsweetened. These, what? I have a Oh, you just hang on. These go pure bars. We're on for $2.97. Jacob likes those in his lunch. Granola bars were $1.97. Mama, Emily is here beside me. Mama, look at that. Look at that. You were with me when I bought all these things, weren't you? Strawberry. Strawberry jam. Um, these kind bars were on sale for three forty-seven. dollars so I thought they would be just a little healthy kind of a sweet treat. 
Um, for cereal this week, I picked up some mini wheats. This is the big box, and okay, apparently you get oh by any two specially marked boxes, and you get a free ball. Um, some brown sugar mini wheats. They were on sale for five forty-seven, and just a great value. Um, Rice Krispies. I have a bag of marshmallows in the cupboard that have been sitting there for a while, so I thought that we could make some Rice Krispie squares. Um, one carton of milk for Ben. I've been thinking more and more that Ben is lactose intolerant and last night um, he had some pains in his belly and um, he did have milk so I had him tested for celiac disease because I thought maybe he might have that and he doesn't. His blood work came back that he doesn't have that but I'm wondering if maybe he's lactose intolerant so I bought him some lactose free milk. Um, I picked up two cartons of cream that was $6.48. Um, two cartons of coffee cream. They were $5.48 each. Um, some milk. These were also $6.48 each. I just picked up two bags. Um, chicken nuggets. These were $5.97. The kids always enjoy taking those in their lunch. I picked up a block of lactose-free um, cheese for Ben as well. I was trying to find lactose-free yogurt, but I couldn't find any. And then I also picked up just a regular um, marble. Two of those. And the last thing I got in Walmart, the bubbly was on sale for $4.97, so I picked up a blackberry and a lime. All right, well, this is everything that I picked up in Superstore. Not a whole ton of stuff for $85 and uh, 23 cents, but I will show you what I picked up. I had a few substitutions. Um, I picked up some of these uh, pizza pops. Um, Superstore has been doing like um, deals. It's like a monthly deal and those deals will be on all month. So this was one of them. Um, our store is really bad for not having the items in stock. So I was kind of surprised that they had these. But um, the Pillsbury Pizza Pops were on for $3. So I picked up three boxes of those. I just thought that they would be a good snack. I'm not sure if the kids would like taking those in their lunch or not, but um, they were on for $3. Um, I had asked for battered fish, but I guess they were all out, so they substituted for um, some haddock fish sticks, which is fine. They were um, $8.99, but I got them for $5.99, if you remember. I picked up some kibasa, a very small package of that. That was $5.00. A romaine salad. These were $3.99. I had asked for, um, ordered two packages of blueberries that were supposed to be $3.99, but I guess they didn't have any of um, the packages that were on sale, so they must have substituted and gave me four of those. Um, so I was fine with that, and I got um, so like these two packs for um, $3.99. So $3.99 for those, and $3.99 for those. Um, a flour was on sale for $2.99, so I just picked up two uh, bags of all-purpose flour. Um, chips were on for $3.29, I think, so I picked up a bag of ketchup and a sour cream and onion. I had ordered a three-pack of cucumbers, um, but I guess they didn't have those, so they gave me three individual ones. Um, and these were $5.49, but then they took $2 off, so I got these for $3.49. So that was a good deal because I think they actually were um, in the flyer for $5.49. I picked up another bag of apples just because they were on for a good price. These were $5.99 if you remember in Superstore. And um, our kids really enjoy apples, so they will definitely get eaten up. These Cliff Bars is something um, new. I've only bought these once before. Um, these were on sale for $14.99, if you remember. And um, this box was open when I got it. It wasn't, it wasn't opened quite this much, but I opened it up further just to make sure uh, that the entire box was there. So these are just like a chocolate chip protein bar. I think the other kind that we tried it was um, macadamia. These ones are chocolate chips, so I just thought that they would be a good um, thing to put in Dave's lunch, and um, Jacob has already asked if he could take one in his lunch. I picked up two packages of these, um, just the no-name disinfectant wipes. Um, they were two, $2.99, I believe. Um, bagels were $2.49, so I picked up two packages of everything bagels. And that was everything that I got in Superstore for $85. And then I actually ran into Walmart after I did my curbside pickup. I ran into Walmart and I picked up a tub of sour cream. That was on for two, or wasn't on, that's $2.97 um, regular. Um, two blocks of butter. They were six something each. I wanted to get some command hooks for um, these ones I bought to put. I want to put one on our... Um, 
keyboard or piano in the living room for Ben to hang his headphones on. And then I bought this small package because I want to hang my measuring cups on the back of my cupboard. They were $5.28 each. I picked up two packages of these gloves. Oh, there's two pairs there. They were $2, but they were on sale for $0.40. Cents. And then I picked up, I was trying to find girl ones and boy ones. These ones are navy blue and um, light blue. So I'll just tuck those away for um, next fall. I find these gloves are always good for just when the weather um, starts to get cold and the kids just need a little something on their hands. They're obviously no good for this time of year because they would never keep your hands dry or uh, warm. Band-Aids, I will have to hide these from Emily. These were $5.47, I think. Um, she loves Band-Aids, so I will have to hide those. And the last thing I picked up was one of these night lights. I have one of these already in our kitchen, and I really like it. It automatically um, turns on when it gets dark and then turns off um, when it's bright. Um, I want to put this in the um, bathroom downstairs because I often leave a light on um, just for Jacob if he has to get up through the night. And um, I just thought a night light would be better for that. Oh, and I also picked up a container of multivitamins for the kids. I had bought another kind not too long ago and the kids really, really didn't like them. They found them really gross. So I ended up um, getting rid of those ones and I picked them up these ones because I know that they uh, like those ones. And everything that you see there came to 56, um, 56, 60 because the vitamins um, were kind of expensive and butter it doesn't take long to spend you know 60 or a hundred dollars so all total today i spent a total of um 227 dollars and 32 cents but my total would have been 200 and $57.32, but I redeemed $30 in points at Walmart. So that is everything that I picked up for our groceries for this week. All right, well, that is everything that I have to share with you guys in this video. I hope you enjoyed seeing what we picked up for our groceries this week. Um, it's currently Friday here. I don't usually get groceries on Friday um, for the simple reason that I feel like when Monday rolls around and it's time to pack lunches, I feel like a lot of our fresh fruit is gone. So I may have to take a trip uh, back to the store next week. But anyway, that is what we picked up today. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Thank you for watching, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.